come on. Seriously. What does it take to kill you? Is pepper not enough? I'm pretty sure it probably isn't enough. Oh, stop locking on. If I press the button to lock on when I'm locked on, it means stop locking on. Not stop locking on and then go into the fucking free aim mode. Come on. As soon as you're dead, we can have a little pause and check some stuff. Well, the T does seem to be an improvement. It is, but I can't move. Okay, there we go. And that locking on, I can move. When I'm locked on, I can't move. Brilliant game design. I really don't want to be bashing the game design, but look, why has the FPS just suddenly saved itself? It's because all the liquid over there disappeared. Oh boy. Well, that was interesting, wasn't it? I don't even know. How am I getting so many roses? I thought I only had like. No, oh, actually, I, uh, I don't. I've. I mean, like, I didn't mean like roses and health pickups. I mean, like, I thought I had a lot more health than uh, I actually did have. Oh man. Deary me. Seriously, as I thought better than you. Look at the destruction around you. Consider its cause. Then come join me. That looks like end game over there, because there doesn't look like anything connecting it to the rest. But hang on, one second, I will quickly just check my hardware and one after one quick fucking second. Right, that's it. There's no explanation. Thirty degrees Celsius. The CPU is that. GPU about forty 40, 45 to 55 like it started at about 55 and then since you know I tabbed out and the game was not running in like the primary thing it, it went down to about 45 so I don't really understand it, it can't be me because my, my specs smashed the specs like the recommended specs for this game I really uh, hmm until I get more evidence on this and by evidence I mean like you know, look it up a bit. I'm just going to assume that it's either the recording equipment, which isn't actually a very big possibility because DX3 is not in load bearing at all, really. Very pleasant. I'm just going to assume that it's either the game being poorly optimized, which is, you know, a possibility. Quite a strong one, I'd say. Oh no, that's the wrong gun. Still hit him though, I'm satisfied. So if we're gonna be that or um the fucking it's just a sloppy port, which I guess those two pretty much classify as the same, don't they? Right, enough with the T, enough with life. Come on. I've had enough. I wanna get out of this goddamn area so that I can go have some fun somewhere else. Oh you bastard. Like one of the few enemies that's actually gotten a hit on me. Ow, jeez. I didn't even take damage, but still. Ow. Figurative ow. Oh, come on. Don't waste my time. Dwemer pot. Maybe that's when the Dwemer died out. They made these pots and they sort of, uh... Let's get Skyrim and this actually came out the same year, didn't they? The Dwemer made these pots and they sort of went rogue and murdered and mur murdered everyone. Right, so there was nothing here but death, really. Thanks. Maybe there was, don't care. Can't be bothered. This isn't the proper level, I hope, because of, um... You know, we started the last level, or the last chapter, and it was icy, and we were in the default outfit, and then it went all underwater, and we changed outfit. This time, you know, we started in this mad low FPS place, and we're in the default outfit, so I'm hoping it will transition to something new. And, uh, the outfit will change again, like, on the... as a side note, but will hopefully be in a different place altogether and it will stop this horrible lag. Please, answer my prayers. You are familiar with the saying that smoking stunts your growth? Adults assault children with that adage, usually while they've got a pipe stuck in their mouths. I won't ask you to inhale. Let the smoke envelop you. Okay, we've experienced this before, but it was liquid, not weed. Alice is a smoker. Respect lost. Wow. Okay, so the world hasn't changed, but there's Mandarin, and it's very laggy while it's loading in, and there's fish, 
Mysterious East. This is quite racist so far. There's more teapots, of course. Wow. Okie doke. Yeah, that looks very racist. Floating bars of soap. 60 FPS. My god, I told you. That is quite cool, actually. I approve. Incense. Oh my god. Oh, so racist. We took smoke-based drugs. We're now wearing some floral print... Yeah, you... I don't even want to say it, but still. You know what I find is the best thing about this game so far? Well, actually, no, that's probably a bit of an overstatement. Or, oh, if that's over-exaggeration, maybe. The author obliterated the distinction between poetry and fiction. That makes no sense to me, Cat. I'm sorry. You know what? I'm just going to say it. The boots and the socks. I'm not even sure if they are socks. They're probably stockings or tights or whatever the fuck you want to call them. All the same to me, the lingo doesn't matter. Apart from when you're looking up porn, but still. They work really well. And give... Excuse me. The fuck? Right, okay. That won't come through on the recording, but still. It's my fucking mic's USB. It's gone a bit fiddly and it's making some weird noises. It sounds like someone, like, a baby crying almost. <laughs> yeah, I'm just, I'm just not going to elaborate on what I just said, because out of context that is a bit weird. It's just one of those looks that I really like. Uh, you know, on females. Because I am a man, I have that kind of thing in my nature, but still. Oh, I say man. Had this discussion in the, th the second recording session of this game. Don't know if I can call myself that, but as a, like, male in the gender spectrum. Is that a word? Probably not. There's, there's not really a spectrum for genders, is there? But, you know, it's something that I... Hmm. I, I still can't figure out the right, right word. I applaud it more than Ugg boots, let's say that. And this has been a bit of a weird thing to start saying in the middle of a recording session. Maybe that's the reason I started playing this game. Wink, wink, it's not. I literally just, you know, I've, what were the game candidates? I don't even explain what they were. I had loads of candidates to play game, like, get a playthrough. I had Call of Juarez Gunslinger was one of them. Then there was this. I think World of Goo. That was like sort of a puzzle game. Something like that. But it was one of the Splinter Cell games that I, uh, I got in like a, um, a bundle. There were, Actually, quite a few. There were Warhammer 40k, all those and stuff. I got loads of them in the um, the bundle that gave me like Saints Row as well. I would have been playing. I could have played through those, but that wouldn't really have been blind. So I kind of ruled them out. Then there was like what uh, Medal of Honor. No, that's not the right one. There was the other one that's like Medal of Honor, uh, Homefront. And then are these fish dangerous? Do you reckon? I can get up there. It might be able to. Huh. Well, fuck it, I'll go through the game again and get the 100% and come back and show you guys and I will have gotten that hopefully, maybe. Yeah, there's there's quite a few games on my Steam library. I guess I could check now if you really do want me to know. Or if you really do want me to be able to tell you so that you know. But to be honest... Oh, hello. A bar of soap with weird faces on them. Didn't even pick up on that. But you know, this one came out on top. Both, you know, figuratively, figuratively and literally, because it is the top game on my Steam library. Lord Dodgson is a pathetic sailor and an even worse captain. We'd have run aground on the ISIS if I hadn't taken an oar. I'm not sure why this has been so racist. It suddenly turned into soap, floral print dresses, weird masks as seen on the back of this dress, Mandarin floating in the sky, fish, like, it's all, like... Japanese fish, like fish and Japan and Chinese, I guess, are all sort of really closely related. Like, you always get fish related stuff in uh, in Japan, don't you? Like, Ashton's does this Japanese seafood special. Just the ocean and Japan are quite tight, I guess, because they're a small island. And then there's the incense burning, and the weird sort of temple y decorations, and the weird music, and these weird dragons from Shaolin Showdown. God. Shaolin Showdown still a thing. I have to admit that that was like one of the best fucking cartoons like ever. I don't fucking care. I've never watched this stupid bullshit Dragon Ball Z crap. Who fucking cares about that? Shaolin Showdown. 
God, I'm going to have to go look that up and watch some episodes after this. That was like the fucking best thing in the world. Shaolin Showdown. Can't believe that. What happened to Cartoon Network and like Nickelodeon and all the other good channels with funny cartoons on like in the morning that we always used to watch before school? What happened to those? Those were amazing. Ah. Oh. Oh, now I really miss my childhood, even though it was, like, not too long ago at all. I thought I could smash through that. Very ominous looking at the different colour. I wonder how I did survive. Oh, man. Poor little dead rat buggers. They look like they've been shot by the bloodstains on them. Although it looks more like they've been crucified. That's a bit racist as well. 